Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make zip lines in Fortnite UEFM. So, yeah, they basically work exactly how they do in Battle Royale. And yeah, we're going to jump straight into how to make them and how to angle them and everything like that. The first thing we're going to want to do is go into the all folder and search zip lines or just zip line or whatever. There we go. And now we are looking for two things. We are looking for the zip line pole and the zip line spline. So the first thing we're going to want to do is place down a pole in the first place we want the zip line. So I'm going to put mine right here on the edge of this mountain. Once we have our zip line pole down, we want to drag the zip line spline and just drop it right somewhere we can see it. So as you can see, it is quite small. So you're just going to want to make sure you can see where it is. And then we're going to select it and we're just going to move it to roughly where our zip line pole is. Perfect. And then we're going to get our end and we're going to drag it to hopefully make it match the end of the pole. You can see that that does not match at all. <laughs> and that's why we can just keep moving and adjusting until we have it perfectly put in there. And there you go. Just like that, we have the zipline nicely attached to our zipline pole. The next thing we're going to want to do is head over to the other side. So increase our camera speed a bit. We're going to drag another zipline pole on the other end where we want the zipline to finish. So I'm thinking right on the end here is probably the best. And basically we're going to want to grab the end selection point on the zipline. And basically we just want to drag it. So zoom out a bit. And just extend it all the way. Basically as far as we can to reach the other zipline pole. So just, it's just a matter of moving it and finding the right position. As you can see now, we've got it pretty close. We wanna, once again, put our camera speed down so we can be a bit more precise. It is gonna take a little bit of fiddling around to make to get it exactly how you want to. But once you have it right, it should look pretty good. So just like that, you see it's nicely connected to the end of our zipline pole. And we have two really nice zip lines. And if we go back to the other side, you'll see that it is still nicely connected. If you want to add a nice sort of like curve to your zip line to look like it's drooping down, like a more realistic zip line, I guess, that's where you want to select one of the points. And you'll see sticking out the back will be a, a sort of line. And this is sort of your curve. So if we drag this down, you'll see the curve start to change on the zip line. So just like that, curves down a bit. And same with this one, we want to select this side and just curve it down until you get a nice sort of curvature you're happy with. So just like that, we've got a nice sort of curved zipline now. As you can see, it sort of droops down like a real zipline would. And basically, after you've got that, your zipline should be done. So what you want to do now is just press launch session to launch up the session in game. Now, as you guys can see, once we've loaded into the game, we can see our beautiful zipline there. And as you can see, it's nicely connected to the pole we added. And if we hop in, it works exactly like ziplines in game. So you see it's starting to make the crank sounds as we go up a bit. And then pop us off right at the other sides. And as you can see, once again, we've got a nicely connected zipline. If this tutorial did help you guys, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. Have a great day, guys.